Ok, Diosan. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I am playing Liu Bang. This is my second match with him. We played a match before and we we did we did okay, but we didn't win the match and there wasn't anything too special for me to show the match. So I decided to play one more. And I'm going for the tank build first. We are laning against Li Xin who's going for surprisingly the attack item first. So maybe he'll play the domination form. Okay, we can deal a lot of damage to him because um, one he he doesn't have the boot set so usually they go for the cooldown boots with legion right but yeah he will try to hit me and i got hit there but that's not ideal i should try to avoid the uh, avoid getting hit by him because if i get hit by him he will get levels which is which is very good for him he'll get level four before me Okay, we, we can just keep poking him like this, wait for our enhanced auto attack to come up. Can you use it to clear the waves or you can also use it to hit him, depending upon the situation. Okay, yep, he knows what he's doing, he's just, uh, he's just standing away, waiting for the, waiting for the minions to get to low HP and then first ability. That is how you play it very safe with that hero. Okay, unfortunately the enemy Wukong has got, uh, a double kill at the top so that's not good okay i think he is probably getting that creep right now okay now we have our ult yeah he got the creep so we can go we can go wherever we want let's form these these creeps Nice. Nice, we did a lot of damage to him. Okay, Dianwei. I don't know why Dianwei just engaged because I couldn't really go. I didn't have my second ability. I just used the second ability right there. Okay, I am a tank so... We don't really need to like, oh no, someone help me, Wukong is attacking, you know, we can just, we can manage if we play it properly. But he has some gold, so keep that in mind. Okay. I think execute is better for him because usually you see enemies going out with very little HP and you will not be able to get the, the hit. And like, even if you engage like this. See, we made her use all her uh, abilities, which is fine, which is which doesn't matter. I can just use this heal, then go back and pick up my own heal and then I'll be back to full HP. But we did manage to get that kill. So that is what matters. So it's nice. So the combo is like you turn on your shield, then dash, attack and shield and like that is how you poke. So pretty much that is how, that is all the damage output that he can provide, I think. He's not really like stand in the middle and just 1v5 kinda guy, he just goes in, then uh, one explosion, one enhanced auto attack and maybe a few auto attacks, that's it. So, okay, I could have, I could have gone there but I was busy commentating, so next time, next time we'll go. If uh, Dio Chan is fighting, it'll be nice if we can go and help. I think that is why AS picked uh, Dio Chan, so. Uh, it will be a very good synergy with this hero. We can try to attack Legion. Yep, he's right here. Nice, nice damage to him. And the rest of his abilities can't hit me. Only this ability can hit me. Before he uses, before he can use the others, I can just get away. Okay, is he like taking the fight fully? Or? Okay, the opponents aren't attacking. So th this is kind of hard with this hero. You have to like. Uh okay, nice. You have to know what's going on and all the time you have to also keep that in mind as you're fighting your own laner in your lane. So that is the that is the hard part I guess. 
if you are not able to go there and especially if your teammates are not like pinging because we don't really have a plan right here i didn't tell yes to like uh, say attack or something like that when you want my help and i will come <laughs> we are just going based off i am just looking looking to see if he needs my help we also have a dian way which is also a very good combo for my hero to be uh, used with nice we cleared this now we are free to go he is right there we are level 8 okay can attack him just do the standard combo and oh, got away now we can attack oh man <laughs> see whenever i'm trying to escape you just immediately need to tap it okay you don't need to wait for it to give shield for anyone you just need to instantly tap it and get away from there uh, as you saw me do right there i didn't like try to give shield for dio chan i just clicked on her instantly tapped it and teleported over there and uh, yeah we got away but unfortunately they surrounded her and finished her off <laughs> okay we got the the mid lane tower for that which is nice uh the opponents just they were just going for the kill which is which is why they lost the mid lane tower and we didn't lose any towers in the process okay i don't know about this i don't know why he's changing this form because i think his build is for, yeah his build is for the the domination form okay we might need to go top depending upon what's going to happen yep we can go Okay nice nice nice. I knew that she will be having her flicker but now the problem is I came here before clearing the wave this. <laughs> this is a mistake but I I think if I waited any longer our boy Luban might have died so sometimes you just need to give up your tower I guess but don't do that don't do that. <laughs> Let Luban die your tower is more important but but I think it's overall it turned out to be advantageous for me because we got two towers. and uh, we only lost one so i think it's debatable i think what i did there was all right because they just they were like coming right under the tower just to devour our luban our poor luban and i just came there and changed everything as soon as i arrived the enemies just ran nice did some damage so we just need to okay we are against a very uh, aggressive split pusher so this is kind of tricky so he will never leave his lane right but since he's playing this form he might leave his lane now and then but uh, we'll see but uh, this is where our hero is better we clear the wave and still join the fight while his hero has to just stay back okay hitting the tower a little bit nice nice engage by him do they need my help no not yet okay they are they are good if u kang engages i have to go okay. i have to watch out all the time okay dio chan nice 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 okay the range is just annoying like he's running away with that one hp and i'm not able to save him and nice we saved dio chan there and we turned the whole fight around which is exactly the point of this hero this is how the hero is supposed to be played and it's a very good combo by the way very nice choice by ace right there to pick uh, yeah stupid minion okay guys be careful okay he's dead okay luban i don't have my ult yet get away from there Okay, now I'm going to push this lane a little bit because the minions are crashing. So if I clear it, it'll be nice. And if it'll be nice if Luban can. Okay, let me ping. Yeah, he's going. So Luban will clear the bottom. Hopefully, safely, not putting himself out for Legion to eat. Yep, yep. They are saying retreat command for him. Okay, nice. So we cleared that. Okay we can engage. Let's tell him to attack. Let's see if he is attacking or no, he is just walking away. Okay, 
can clear this one more wave immediately. Okay. I'm a tank, so it's not a it's never an easy kill if they're trying to kill me, that is. Okay, healed everyone. Okay, attack, 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 attack guys, attack. Ah, oh, the slow from this milady. I think it's milady slow. She's just annoying. She has the... Who's slow? Oh, it's Hoi slow then. Okay, we'll go to the bottom lane now. Okay, we go here, we clear this lane since our top lane is pushing so this is like you you can see how repetitive it is i just do something then immediately leave go to some other lane and that is how you maximize the use of this hero so you instead of just standing there with your team and doing stuff maximize the use of your hero go around clear minions that are so far away from the rest of the team so that you will make the enemy legion come there to defend you then you teleport and go to your fight and make it unfair 5v4 Okay, so the top lane is pushing, I go there now, since our teammates are like, kinda moving towards the bottom and the enemies are also, see, they are also in the bottom. So now my job is in the top lane, so I go all the way over there now. <laughs> so we clear this and then we do whatever, unless it's a very big emergency and I immediately need to go. Okay, I think it's, okay, they got it. <laughs> they don't need my help right now. Okay, Milady is right here, see. So their mage is not in the fight and we have our mage in the fight. Oh. <laughs> that little bit of it's, uh, th the shield that we gave. Okay then we go clear the, the top. See the bottom is pushing now. <laughs> the minions are crashing in the bottom. We can't allow that. Okay, now we go to the bottom. I think Dianwe will go to the bottom actually after clearing that. Yeah, he is going to the bottom, but I'm also going to come. Okay, okay. Okay, they are here. Since everyone is kinda like moving towards the bottom lane. Okay, he made my shield explode before I can get close to him, which is which is smart. But uh, it's very easy to break his shield in the late game. It, it doesn't have too much hit points. So if the shield breaks before you can go close to an enemy, you just uh, deal 50% of the damage if the explosion hits. If not, then you deal no damage. Okay, now the enemies are all moving towards the top. Yeah, I tried, I tried, but that was just way too much damage for me to even go and save him. You saw how I was giving him shield, but still, taking the full damage from a marksman, I don't think the shield will be enough to save you at that point. Maybe I should have immediately ulted on him as soon as he engaged, then I would have saved him, but uh, I, I was a bit too late. And the damage was too high on their side. Okay, we got everyone. Then the match is over. Nice. Uh, we didn't really do too much anything too spectacular in this match. But we did do what we were supposed to do. And that is how you are supposed to play him. You just stay away from your team. Stay away from the enemy team. And clear wave somewhere. Make the enemy come there and defend you. And you just go and immediately start a fight. And you win the fight because you have an advantage. And he works very well with Dio Chan as the mid laner, Dianwe as your jungler, Kaiser, Dianwe, all these very tanky junglers who just go in and just fight for a very long time. You can just go on top of them and give them even more sustain and also uh, damage from your side. So yeah, that was a very solid match. We didn't die even once that match. We just fight, we take damage, we retreat. We then go around and then uh, 
we do the same thing over and over again we did only 30% damage which is which makes sense because we weren't really fighting all that much but our luban has did 46% damage so well played by luban anyways that's going to be it for the video guys i hope you all found this video entertaining and helpful and if you did make sure to support me by hitting the like and subscribe button i hope you all have a really great day and i'll see you guys in the next video